Hi guys, this is Pierre and in this video I am going to show you how to make a logo like this. Uh, so to make a logo like this we need to get a software which is GIMP. The link will be provided in the description for it. So just open the open up GIMP. This is the startup screen of GIMP. And then here it will look something like this. Then click on file new then take the width nine hundred and height nine hundred and then click on OK and now here it is now just select the ellipse selection tool first you have to create a new layer then click on OK and select the ellipse selection tool and draw a circle on it over here like this and now just select the blend tool and here the upper color which we have want to queue is just type um just a second uh, i will provide some codes in the description that you have to just click on this here and you have to paste it into html notation and then just click on ok and select the back color um, I will put this all the numbers for the color in the description which you, have to, which you have to just paste in here and then just click ok and select the blend tool and drag it from top to bottom on the circle and then just click on select none again click on new layer icon and just click ok and select, select the ellipse selection tool and draw a second circle like this uh, the second circle should be little bit smaller than the first circle and then select the blend tool and here we have to select the orange color um, yeah like this and just click on ok and for back color you have to select the purple purple color these codes for orange and purple color will be provided in the description and then just click on ok you have to take the upper color as orange and lower color as purple and select blend tool and drag it from top to bottom on the second circle like this and then just click on select none now we have to draw a third circle so click on new layer icon click ok select the ellipse selection tool and draw third circle on the second, cir second circle make sure that the third circle is smaller than the second circle yeah like this and then over here you can see then just select the blend tool and put the first curve the colors which have, we have took for the first circle just put it over here means the codes and for second yeah select the blend tool and drag it from top to bottom on third circle like this and click on select none and now we have to put our name means the text so click on this uh, text tool icon then for this tutorial I am using the font called uh, true lies just a second yeah as you can see true lies and then just type in I will type in my name and just double click on the text and increase its size like this uh, I think it's too big so decrease its size and decrease it for oops
you can take your text out from the third circle or you can put it in I'm going to take it a little bit out yeah like this and just now right click on your text layer click on alpha to selection and select the third circle which we have drawn its name is layer number 2 and just hold control on your keyboard and press X now click on select none now as you can see here the on select the your select our text layer and you can see here a little bit icon just click on it and here is our logo and if you want to save this logo then just click on file export to I'll select my desktop and just give it a name and make sure the extension is png.png and here you can see here all images just make your png image and click on export and you will get this menu just copy my settings and click on export and wait up till this progress bar is, is finished and then go to the location where you have exported your logo as you can see my logo is on my desktop yeah here it is if you like this video then please give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more videos thank you guys for watching and i will see you in the next one